Bakit tayong mga Pilipino na nandito sa Amerika, bakit hindi natin pinopromote na ang mga second generation na marunong silang magtagalog? And just recently, no, to, to be honest with you, my youngest one asked me, Dada, kami never, bakit di mo ko tinuruan magtagalog? Hello everyone, this is Elizabeth Velasco from the Velasco team of Remax Gold and this is Alvin Respo with Supreme Lending and welcome to our sixth episode of Bahay Pinoy Sa Tate. <laughs> okay, it. kumusta na Alvin? Okay naman, everything is good, thank you so much. Okay, oh. are you excited? We're on our sixth episode, ha? Grabe, nasa sixth episode na tayo. Oh, bilis ano? Oh, bilis, sobra. Ang dami mga topic na pag-usapan. And Correct. I know we're gonna be talking more in the future. Yes, oo. Oh, so anyway, um, yung topic natin today is something about may, baka medyo controversial. As in controversial talaga to? Yeah, oh. kasi guilty ako dito oh. eh. Pero at least hindi siya rated... Ano, rated, hindi siya rated PG, ano lang talaga. For rated everyone. PG. Rated yes. PG ba? Okay. Oh, yeah. Ang susunod na programa ay rated PG. Patnubay at gabay ng magulang ay kailangan sa mga batang manunood. <laughs> <laughs> Kasi ganito. Mm, okay. um, wala ka bang napapansin? Okay. Bakit ba, I know we're first, uh, actually first generation mm-hmm. ako dito sa, ano, US. States, okay. Sa States. Mm-hmm. Napapansin ko, yung mga uh, anak natin o yung mga susunod ng generation, oh. bakit hindi sila nakakapagsalita ng Tagalog o naka-fluent sa Tagalog? Mm, tama. Is it because na tayo bang mga magulang mm-hmm. o tayo bang mga nauna dito hindi natin in-enforce? Tama. Or is it because sa kagustuhan na rin natin na ayaw natin silang matutong magtagalog Tama. or is it because i mean we're trying to westernize them yes. the best we could Somehow. ano bang ano bang ano bang masasabi mo diyan i mean on your personal experience you know mahaba-habang discussion to guys but we will try to i will try to explain my side yes this, oh, you know? tell me kasi you have four kids I have diba four boys and guess four what boys. one of the things and just recently you know to, mm-hmm. to be honest with you my youngest one asked me dad how come you never but di mo ko tinuruan magtagalog oh diba? yeah oh, oh, oh. totoo to so i'm like it, it came into my mind parang bakit nga ba Right? Oo nga, bakit? Bakit nga ba hindi ko tinuruan magtagalog yung anak ko? And it's weird kasi nga, you know, we never thought this eh. Hindi natin as, as, as they grow and doon nagsasal- nagsasalita kami ng Tagalog sa, sa, loob, sa loob ng bahay. Oh, Pero tsaka we, pareho kayong mag-asawang Pilipino, Pilipino diba? We never enforced na, oh, magtagalog kayo. Correct. O matuto oh. kayo or even sit down with them na, hey, ito yung mga Tagalog na dapat mong malaman, you know, mm-hmm. basic ones. And I think more really, to be honest with you, is we never really thought about it. One, number two, um, we just never thought it's important. Because yeah. yeah, we want you know we want them in somehow uh, blend in to or, blend, or to, well not to blend in, but we didn't we didn't care if it's gonna matter or what not. Yes, Hindi correct. Natin alam. Oh, Hindi natin alam. Yes, diba? actually. Um, oh. I mean, I feel the same way. Oo. Kasi ako at Mr. Ko, pareho kaming Pilipino, pareho kaming nagtatagalog. Oo, oo. Actually, kaming mag-asawa, oo. Tagalog ang salita Pero namin. wala sa anak niyang nagtatagalog? Wala yun. nga rin. Tayo, yung, yung panganay ko, nakakaintindi siya. Oo. Pero yung bunso, talagang oo. totally, talagang oo, oo. wala. Hirap. Oo, wala <laughs> so, talaga. Oo. So, it's like, oo. sometimes I think na, bakit ba natin hindi oo. natin oo. in-enforce? Kasi a lot of, family household Uh-oh. na katulad ng mga Hispanic, di ba? Talagang Uh-oh. Ispan- Uh-oh. Hispanish sila sa Uh-oh. bahay. Uh-oh. Kasi in their mind, actually, tinanong ko isang kliyente ko, paano natuto mag-Spanish yung mga anak mo? Uh-oh. Sabi niya, sa murang, you know, pagkabata pa lang, talagang required nila Spanish sa bahay. Parang, ano talaga? Uh, Yun ang salita nila. Kailangan talaga. Yeah, kasi oh. ang, sa, ang katwiran niya, pag nag-aral yan, English di naman ang matututunan. Tama. So, tama. Walang, walang problema doon. So, bakit nga ba? Okay, maybe Al- because do you think kasi English is our second language yeah. in the Philippines? Tama rin yun. Correct, di ba? Tama, makes sense. Oo, oo. I think it is, 
that, that plays a big part kasi nga mm. English talagang <clears throat> tayo nung nasa Pilipinas tayo yeah yung, yung yun, form of uh, school instruction yun, yun second diba? language natin yun eh yes you know, from the school growing up yun yes talaga, oh, eh. written and yeah, you know exacto. you know uh, verbal yeah. diba so I think that's a that's a big kung ba a, a big uh, part of it right kasi we never really thought na parang importante siya importante siya correct okay. and you're right about that kasi some of my clients mm. Elizabeth to be honest with you yung mga magulang nila right oh talk talk to my son pagka hindi makakaintindi or more may language barrier kami oh nga diba silang para yeah. translator oh, oh. And, diba? they're, and they're they were born here yes diba? and correct and tama siya doon then nakakapag-spanish sila yes yeah. and, and, and I guess I, again I think big part siguro is because our second language is basically English then kasi yeah. oh. pero bakit tayong mga Pilipino na nandito sa Amerika bakit hindi natin pinopromote na ang mga second generation na marunong silang magtagalog kasi itong hindi ko maintindihan mm-hmm. ha uh-huh. okay so they go to high school uh-huh. here in the states yeah. Diba required ang Spanish class, Tama diba? Uh, okay. Uh, uh, so they go to college required my foreign language, foreign diba? Language, correct. Okay. Yes. So bakit, you know, tayo na napaka-accessible na Uh-oh. magulang magulang mo nakasama mo every day na nagtatagalog. Yeah. Bakit yung maanak natin hindi natin tinuruan magtagalog? Nga, uh, And I will tell you my part, okay? okay? All right. Actually, kaming mag-asawa, when I think about it, para ba siguro, you know, tamad kami. Yun. We got lazy. Oh, oh. Kasi we want something, it's easier for us to yeah. speak in English yeah. na lang, di ba? Mm-hmm. Kasi since English is our second language, mm-hmm. and English naman talagang salita dito, oh, oh. so para bang, o oh, sige, English na lang. Oh, oh, oh. Pa- parang ganun. Oh. Kasi it's not easy to, you know, speak to Tagalog. teach your oh, oh. children, oh. especially pag bata pa sila ng Tagalog, di ba? Oh, oh. So what about you? Ano ganun, naman ang kaso sa'yo? Ganun din ako. I think... Tinamad ka rin. Hindi, hindi lang tinamad. Parang mahirap yatang turo ng Tagalog ng anak ko, di ba? Walang time. I don't have the patience. You know, una, patience una, yun. Diba? yun. I una, think una, that's una. true. Patience talaga. Talagang, you have, you have to understand kasi Tagalog yan eh, di ba? Um, I think that's what it is. For me, it's more, wala akong patience para magturo. Pangalawa, wala akong time, di ba? Mm-hmm. And, and knowing that it's not easy. It's not easy. It's not okay, easy. I'll tell you what it is. Mm-hmm. Okay, yung, yung mga anak ko, uh, the first few years until mag-kindergarten sila, Uh-oh. yung mother ko ang nagbe-babysit sa kanila. Oh, mm-hmm. So, ang nangyari, Uh-oh. yung mother ko, gustong matutong mag-English. Mm-hmm. Tama. So, imbis na other way around, Uh-oh. na dapat yung mga anak ko natutong mag-Tagalog sa ma- kay mama. Sa so, baligtad, oo. Oh, 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 oh. So, si, si mama ang nag-practice ng English sa kanila. Oh, oh, oh. So, made it worse pa. <laughs> Parang <gano. laughs> So, so di ba parang oh, ganun? So, sorry, Mama. <laughs> sorry, Ma. <laughs> Kasi parang mag, imbis na Uh-oh. si Mama ang magturo mag Tagalog, si Mama pa ang nagpaturo Uh-oh. sa kanilang mag-English. So, paano ba yan? Ano bang right tayo? Okay? Kasi Uh-oh. alam na natin, we Uh-oh. identify the problem Uh-oh. Uh-oh. na tayong mga Pilipino dito sa Amerika. Tama. Bakit hindi natin... Uh-oh. Uh-oh pino-promote at saka pinapahalagahan um, ang ating sariling wika kapag Tagalog. nasa Amerika. Oh, oh. Why is that? What do you think? Yeah. Is it because we're trying to westernize our kids? Is it because uh, we don't want them to become fobs? Oh. Okay, uh, sorry guys. Okay, so ano bang definition ng fob? <laughs> dati dati tinatawa. <laughs> Ikaw ah. <laughs> okay, tell me what what is that? Fresh, no? Actually, ang alam ko fresh Fresh, fresh of the boat. boat. Eh, okay, fresh yun. of the boat oh, ibig sabihin nun yung oh, bagong salta. Oh, oh. Yes, oh. Pa- parang pagka bagong salta ka, parang naiiba ka sa lahat. Correct, parang correct. Ganun, and, then, oh. and then and then also oh, what is there is it there's a condescending, they look down on you yeah. if you have an accent? Ako ah, my own opinion to. Yeah, dito, okay, oh, kasi, kasi ilang taon ilang taon ka na dumating dito. dito. Oo, oh, dito na ako nagbali. Ilang taon ka? Oh, bali 12, 12 ako. Okay, you oh. came here when you were 12. Oo, taga tapos. Okay, when you were going to school. Middle school. Did you have accent? Oh, of course. Oh, no. Okay, but, but did... <laughs> American bird now. <laughs> American bird. Uh-oh. Pero anong-ano mo? Um, anong, anong, anong naging experience mo as a 12-year-old it, ito, ito. Uh, fresh off the boat? Yeah, exacto. Tinawag ako ng mga ibang Pilipino ng FOB na. Oh, yeah, tinawag ka na pa. Actually, nakipagsuntukan pa ako dyan. I'm sorry, guys. Pero ay- ayoko maging barumbado. Yeah. Oh, see, It's so, a big thing for me. And you're hmm. right. Because of that, parang I tried to not uh, naging 
Taglish na ako. Oh, ano ganun? So, so, I guess because we don't want our kids to go to through the same way. experience. Or, yeah, oh. or maybe we don't want our kids to like kind of feel, you know, like, uh, what is that? Like, uh, not blend in. Oh, yeah. An F-O-B. And not, yeah. Uh, and, and not <laughs> yeah. be, you know, like, you know, ay- ayaw natin silang maiba. Yeah. Well, come to think of it, to be honest with you, Elizabeth, I think that's probably a huge part of it as well. No? Okay, what yeah. if you think about this, okay? Oh, okay? So remember, you're 12 years old. 12 years old. So ang first language mo is Tagalog. Tagalog talaga. Okay, oh. and then you came here, you oh. learned English. Of course. What about doon sa second generation? Okay. Na dito pinanganak. Dito na mismo. Okay? Oh. But from birth until mag preschool sila, oh. marunong silang magtagalog. Okay. And then when they go to school, nag English. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. So do you think they would still have that accent if they are like four or five years old? Because in the first place, if they are kindergarten, yeah. little kids won't even know if you have accent. Exacto. Because yeah. wala yeah. namang, is there like a discrimination wala, or oh. prejudice wala. when you have an accent? Correct. Wala in, in the, as in, long as you could speak it you yeah yeah because yeah. innocent ka pa nun yes, eh. I tama. mean Uh-oh. when you're five years old you Uh-oh. don't even know if Mm-mm. if it's Mm-mm. like is that the right Uh-oh. Uh-oh. pronunciation tama. Tama. you're still even learning how to speak exacto. and articulate oh, diba? yes, tama yun. so so do you think uh, by learning it very early on like master the Tagalog Uh-oh. language yes. and then learn it uh-huh when you go to elementary school English yeah. or oh. go to kindergarten, yes. that's when you learn English. Yeah. What do you think of that? It's pretty much the same thing, I think. You know, uh, if you learn it early, diba? Yes. Uh, para kumbaga ba, it's embedded na sa'yo, hindi na mawawala. Correct. Okay. Para bang kumbaga sa oh. riding, a, uh, I mean, riding a bicycle oh. or learning how Tama. to swim, oh. diba? Oh. 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 Parang ano na siya eh, parang... Um, you know it na. Oh, nasa, it's in your memory na. Oo oh, oh, nga. Yes. Nasa ka, oh. i- ibuturan na ng oh. pagkatao mo. Oh. Oh. Pero marami hmm. din akong kilala na nandito na sila ng mga 15 years old pero hindi na marunong mag-Tagalog na rin. I don't know why. Oo, oh, oh, yes. I Madami know a lot, of, a lot, of, a lot mm. of people oh. that are like that. Maybe because it's oh. like... They just chose not, not to not to, be, not to yeah, learn it yeah, exactly, or really yeah. totally abandon yeah. their Filipino culture mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. they're mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. maybe mm-hmm. because they're not around Filipino culture yeah. mm-hmm. or they don't know. Yeah. yeah. And you gotta remember a lot of you know Filipino here in the states. Uh-huh. Most of them sa kanila hindi na bumabalik sa Pilipinas. Tama. Wala na silang pamilya. Wala dun. na. As in, dito na talaga. Yes, yeah. correct. So, yeah. I mean, iba-ibang cases yeah. eh yeah. sa bawat yeah. tao, di ba? Tama, tama. So, I think at the end of the day, it's their choice. Exacto. Yes. And uh, to me, to be honest with you, I never really thought or never really learned or understand how important it is. Till my son, actually, literally, talaga siya nasabi niya, bakit di mo ko tinurang mag-Tagalog, dad? Never... You know? para bang, pa, tapos para bang, pag magtatagalog ako pinagtatawanan mo ako parang ganun di ba <laughs> sasabihin mo wag ka na nga magtagalog yun sinasabi mo nahirapan wag ka na magtagalog di ba? kasi iba, iba yung salita oh, iba yeah. yung ano yung so, dating no, di ba? so bumabalik din sa akin bakit nga ba diba? oo nga, nga ba? so I think mm. everybody this conversation it's really number one it's up to you it's an option yes as a parent, as a parent it's, it's gonna oh. be totally but I just wanna bring it up kasi Tama, I'm naman. just trying to understand oh, 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 oh. why bakit nga ba yung oh, okay. second generation generation hindi diba sila na? nagtatagalog di ba at bakit hindi natin i-promote yon sa ating mga anak di ba so but for me i mean my kids they wanted to learn it yeah. so, but they just know the bad words oh. <laughs> and then <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. and then when okay. they speak it it's Uh-oh. like it didn't it doesn't Uh-oh. mean anything to them yeah, yeah. but of course Uh-oh. ibang dating sa akin kasi Tama. naiintindihan ko kung Uh-oh. ano yung word na yon di ba so it's like really it's sometimes it gets funny but sometimes it can yeah. get offensive yeah, di ba exactly. so yeah. kaya i think sa ating mga pilipino talaga iba yung alamin natin ang ating salita tama diba? naman yon tama naman mm. you want you want to be able to make sure that yung simple mga anak na oh nag english ako yung mga anak natin ay hindi nila makalimutan yung maski pa paano yung salitang wika natin which is tagalog naman natin correct diba? yes oh. oh and then even in the philippines so, when i came to the philippines oh, so mm. some of them speak english oh, oh. nagtataglay sila di ba oh, oh tama oh. okay Eh, kasi parang, means na, <laughs> mas parang parang mas magaling pa nga sila mag-English sa amin eh. Ano mas galing mo ha pa? Oo, oh, di ba? Tama? Eh, yeah, yeah, yung mga correct. call center, yung mga, di ba? Oo oh, nga, sinabi oh, mo diba? kasi yung mga virtual assistant oh, oh, doon, di ba? Parang maroon talaga. Oh, tiga, nasaan ka ba? Oh, Pilipinas po ako, sir. Oh, galing mo mag-English. <laughs> correct, oh, correct. So, oh. so tama 'yon. Oh. So, but um tell me um you know with this, you know, with this 
I wouldn't say dilemma or uh-huh. just like uh-huh. this topic. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What do you think that you should have done? You know, you nung mga bata pa yung mga anak mo. Uh-huh. Na you wish you could have done better. Well, I wish that I put some more time talaga na to at least one. I wouldn't say enforce, but teaching them, no, and making sure na maturoan sila ng unang una yung basic Tagalog, mga salita, o yung mm-hmm. unang una. And sana I I could have could have talked to them more in Tagalog talaga because yeah. that way you know umpise right it mm-hmm. starts from you know from 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 the home diba and you know I think at saka yung, sana, yung yun conversation yun every day na gagawin oh, mo yun oh, talagang oh. matututo sila yun nga, sana sana I, I have, libre pa yun nga yun nga <laughs> oh in fact tama ka doon yung yung, yung, yung bunso ko dad can you can you put me to a Tagalog ano uh, tutoring sabi ko ano yung isang sabi ko magbabayad pa ako magruruseta oh, ka di ba sabi ko anyway oh. yun, I, I wish that I'd put some more time sana nagtagalog pa ako sana you know nag, nag-spend ako ng time sa kanila na to be oh, talking oh bakit kaya pakantahin natin sila ng tagalog na karaoke no, sa payun ako sus mariyos <laughs> Ako naman, ano, baka mag... Baka naman mag-ano yun. Sus, Marios. Hindi, hindi. At least, at least uh, ano nila yung pagtamang pagbigkas. Uh, uh, di ba? May sasabihin sana ako. Ayoko na sabihin kasi rated PG talaga na baka maano tayo. Okay, ma-censor uh, oh, tayo. Oh, ma-censor tayo dyan. Pero yes. anyway, yeah. Um, mm. Ikaw naman. Ikaw, you, what, what do you think you should have done? Okay, me, know, I wish what, what I could have done is... Um, kasi yung, bun, yung panganay ko... Uh-oh. Uh, nagkaroon siya ng delay speech man. Oh. Yung speech niya delay. Tama, okay. So nagpa-speech pat uh, therapy siya. Tama, so sabi oh, sa amin ng oh. speech therapist oh. na i-introduce lang one language. Oh, okay. Kasi nalilito yung bata. Alright, tama. So sabi ko naman sa loob-loob ko eh ang dami naman akong kakilala na parehong English Spanish. Oh, oh. Pwede nilang i ano, 'di ba? So anyway, so from there on the English na lang kami, salita namin sa kanya. Mm-hmm. Hindi nag-pick up na yung pag-speech niya. Ngayon, Uh-oh. sumobra naman ang daldan. Oo. Oh, oh. <laughs> Sobra natuto. Okay. Sobra natuto. Uh-oh. Tapos from that point on, parang tinamad na kami. Uh-oh. Hindi na namin talagang in-enforce. Uh-oh. But Uh-oh. I wish, you know, tinuruan namin siya tsaka yung bunso namin Uh-oh. kasi Uh-oh. napaka-advantageous kung tama. marunong ka magtagalog. Tama, tama. I mean, sa mga kliyente ko lang, tama, okay? Tama. Kasi, um, you know, Totoyo. I'm a realtor. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Mostly mga kliyente ko Pilipino, mm-hmm. gusto gusto nila na na, na na isasabi nila sa akin yung nasasaloobin nila Tama. kapag Tagalog. Tama. Tama. Kasi nga iba yung 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 you know yung language Uh-oh. na talagang nararamdaman mo pati yung voice at tone ng Uh-oh. tono ng boses nila Uh-oh. kapag may concern sila o kinakabahan sila, natatakot sila, excited sila, di ba? So, I mean, talagang na-articulate nila at nakukonvey nila yung feelings at saka yung communication nila sa akin. Okay? The communication level is uh, mas, kumbaga, mas impact. Oh, oh, mas impactful. Mas na, ano, na, oh, na, oh, kapag ano, ano kapag oh. yes, oh. So Kaya I wish. Kaya ako minsan nga pag, mm. pag minsan may kliyente ako, di ba? So, yes. Yeah, mm. uh, nag english di ba? At hindi nagtatagalog ba kayo? Di ba? As soon as sinabi niya, oo, nagtatag... Mas nakakain, nagkakaintindihan kami yung dalawa. Oo nga, bigla silang may excited. Sasabi niya, buti na lang, di na ako manonosebleed. Oo. <laughs> Sabi ko, ate, naubusan na ako ng English. But anyway, that's a, that's 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 the truth. And, you know, when when you're speaking the same language, mas iba yung impact ng communication. Communication. At saka talagang komportable sila, ah, di ba? When, mm. when they're talking to you. Yes, uh, at saka, you know, ate, can uh, you help us? Ganun, uh, ganun. Uh, so, iba talaga yung yung nagtatagalog, uh, di ba? Tama yun. Yeah, tama kaya yun. nga, alam mo nga, uh, I mean, uh, some of my clients, uh, they actually just found me on uh, Google. Tama. tama. I-Google lang nila, Filipino realtor in Sacramento. Uh, uh, Aba, si Elizabeth na. Velasco uh, uh, nang lalabas. Uh, 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 so, you know, things like that kasi uh, importante yung, I mean, even my counterparts na realtor on uh, uh, other states, uh, uh, minsan hinahanap nila na someone that Mas speaks Tagalog. Tagalog. Oh, oh. Tama yun. Oh. Kasi imagine yung contracts, di ba? Oo. Oh. Oh. Paano mo, ang kapal-kapal nun, all legal terms, paano oh, mo ma- ma-i-explain, mm-hmm. ma-i-interpret yun in a lay terms in Tagalog. Yeah. Na, na hindi sila parang matatakot. Ano ba ito? Masyado uh, namang maligal. Oh, at confusing to, oh. di ba? I know we understand, they understand English, pero iba pa rin kapag talaga. na-i-explain tama, siya. Naman. Maiba naman ako, if there's yes. any other language, ah, Da, ah? da gusto mong matutunan what would it be 
Ito ah. Ah, ito. okay. Gusto ko ano, Spanish. Spanish talaga. Oo, kasi oh, yung ibang la, yung ibang uh-huh. words nila, di ba, parang Tagalog uh-huh. na. Oo, tama rin naman yun. Oo, yes, tama. Oo. At saka alam mo naman, in California, there's uh-huh. a lot of Spanish, you uh-huh. know, Spanish um, population, di ba? Tama, oo. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. A Hispanic population. Oo nga pala, kasi hindi ka na, hmm. hindi ka na nag-aral, nag-aral ka ba? Di, hindi na, di ba? Hindi. Dito kasi uh, requirement yung Spanish din. Ah, eh. uh, uh-huh. okay. Nag, uh, tapos ako ng high school sa Philippines, uh-huh. pero dito na ako nag-college sa City College of San Francisco. Kasi dito sa middle school, required ka ng mag-Spanish. Mag- Spanish. So, may, we, so we have a little bit of education on that one. Oh, in Spanish. Okay. So if there's any language that gusto ko matutunan, gusto ko maging matutunan ng hapon. Japanese, ang hirap kaya nun. Aring ito. <laughs> oh. eh, pero yun ang gusto ko. Yun ang gusto ah. ko. So may kapatid na kasi ako na nakatira. So sa I Japan. Just, oh, so very uh, ah. helpful sa akin to know more. Ah, correct. Yeah. Oo oh, nga. Aring ito. Aring ito. <laughs> ano, how do you say it? Ano? Ano? Hello? Aring ito. Arigato oh, din. Arigato. Oh, Hindi, yeah. arigato. Diba? Thank you yun, di ba? <laughs> si, kaya oh. kailangan akong matuto. <laughs> Sinabi mo. Sorry. Si, so, sorry. anyway. Uh, uh. Okay, we're like, uh, I wish, you know, uh, kayo namang mga viewers. Yes. What do you think? Do you you think? know, mm-hmm. feel free to make a comment down below. Anong feedback kung an- ninyo? Anong mm-hmm. feedback ninyo? Uh-huh. Kung bakit uh-huh. and why, di ba? Uh-huh. And bakit so, importante ito? Anything that you have to say, please let us know. Yes. And that's and, why we're here. And, right? and we wanted to, yeah. you know, you guys also to be yeah. part of this conversation. Yeah. And any any other topics that you guys want to be able to share with us or want to talk about it, if we know, of course, we want to be able to go ahead and talk about it. But feel free. Yes, yes. feel free. Yeah. And I'm really, thank you, Alvin. Oh. I'm really excited about our podcast because oh, oh. at least marami tayong naituturo oh, o, oh. o napag-uusapan oh. or at the same time, marami tayong naishishare yeah. Yeah. sa ating mga viewers. Yeah. Yeah. Diba? Nandito naman lang kami para mag-chika-chika. Chika-chika. Sinabi mo. Diba? Okay. Yes, importante. oo. So, anyway, um, that's our, what, six episode? Six episode. Oh, oh. Wow. Grabe. And then, we're excited oh. to share you, oh, oh. you know, our next episode next week. Abangan nyo. Maganda yes, yan. abangan nyo yan. Maganda kasi yan. it's gonna be Uh-oh. hot topic pasabog. na naman. Pasabog. Ha? Pasabog. Pasabog. <laughs> so definitely. Uh-oh. So anyway, until next time again, this is Elizabeth Velasco this is from the Velasco team of Remax Gold. And this is Alvin Reyes from Supreme. Blending and stay tuned. Like, subscribe and make comment for Bahay Pinoy, Pinoy sa Tate! Tate.